Here are the top marketing tools that I use for explosive results. The one is for lead generation and prospecting. Industry you wanna target, followed by the location, the radius, and then click search. It will show you all of these leads and then you can use a system to automatically send them dynamic emails. Website two will allow you to find out how hard a niche or a keyword is before you start entering it. Type in the keyword you wanna rank for on YouTube, click research, show you the 10 best ranking videos on YouTube and it will even score each one of them on a factor from 1 to 10 on how good it's been optimized. It will also tell you how hard it is to be in the top 5 rankings or the first page and it will even tell you your potential estimated traffic. Website 3 is for all of your marketing copy from blogs, social media posts, anything you want. I'm going to go ahead and let this software generate some engaging ideas so I can ask my audiences on social media. So I'll enter the topic which is get more followers on Instagram. The audience is going to be influencers and the tone of voice will be casual. Generate and as you can see it's now generated all of these questions that I can ask my audience to increase my engagement. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video and follow this account here's how i've generated nearly ten thousand dollars in the past five and a half months using only quora in the past five and a half months i've generated three hundred and ninety thousand views and if i just refresh it change this to all time you can see three hundred ninety thousand views and if i go to affiliate platform this is my earnings and then i've still got this pending here which equals up to close to ten thousand dollars all we do is answer quora questions and build up traffic and point those people to our products and it works really simple i head over to my copywriting tool called trialjarvis.com click on quora answers i would then head over to quora grab a question someone's asking go into quora paste this in and then do generate as you can see it's created this full-blown answer for me i would simply go ahead and copy click answer paste it in and then highlight an area the highlight tool put in a website and then click post i simply repeat that every single day and if you don't believe me head over to youtube.com slash marty englander go into my playlist and have a look at the quora challenge because i documented every single day of this process for more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video and follow this account here are three google hacks that you may not have known google can do hack number one is google calculator all you need to do is type in your sum for example 10 plus 10 and press enter it's now brought up a little calculator and you can even do more specific sums like enter it's provided the formula google hack 2 is you can tell google the size of images you're looking for and google will only display those sizes so for example let's say you want images 1080 pixel by 1080 pixel go over to images click on the image that is 1080 all of these images will most likely be 1080 and you can do that with any size hack 3 is finding out every single hidden page on almost any website that Google has indexed. Type in site colon and then type in the website. So for example, apple.com. Every single web page here is related to apple.com. We'll be able to find discounts and all sorts of things. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to follow this account and like this video. Here's three incredibly useful website builders that won't cost you a penny. Website one is called card.co and this will design a fully responsive, professionally designed, sleek website in just a few clicks. Website two is called jimdo.com these sort of sites focus more on the small business owner or self-employed they have tons of free templates and a really simple drag and drop editor here's some of the websites that have been created with this site website 3 is called weebly.com this site will allow you to build small static websites all the way to full-blown e-com sites they use a simple drag and drop editor and even offer you free subdomains as well for more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video and follow this account here's three super handy websites for people on the go website one is called skyscanner.net and this is like compare the market website for flights this will scan tons of plane sites and find you the best deals for going away on holiday or taking a weekend away and it will even find you hotel deals as well website two is called just watch if you're someone who goes on the train a lot or flies a lot this website will allow you to stream the latest films and tv shows all from your mobile ipad or your computer website three is called diff checker paste some text in here and 
and I've also pasted slightly different text in here. I'm going to do find difference and you can see it's now highlighted all the words which are different. So for example, the first word here is diff checker and here is Marty. My files, here is your files. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to like this video and follow this account. For all the skeptics and the doubters and the people saying that my analytics are just not true, I'll jump into the statistics and show you one of my YouTube accounts that's generated over 5 million views in 28 days and it's less than 60 days old. Here is a YouTube account that I created in July 26th and today's date is August 31st. If we change this to the last 28 days, your channel got 5,360,169 views in 28 days. Over, over, these are like hundreds of thousands of views every single day. Today generated 2.2 million views in 24 hours. But in the live analytics and you can see 2.3 million views generated yesterday in the space of just a couple of hours. The last 60 minutes you have generated 3,269 views. If you want me to keep posting content like this and showing how I've been doing this, make sure to like this video and follow my account. Here is a YouTube tip that's going to transform your YouTube channel and the way you look at your analytics. Here I am on one of my YouTube channels, which is Marty Anglander. You wanna head over to reach, change it for the last 90 days. Now you can see that my YouTube channel has had a total of 398,000 impressions, but only 47,000 views is an average click-through rate of 6.6%, which fluctuates on a regular basis. Now for those if you don't know what impressions are, type in something like a video, my videos here, and as you browse, this is what's classed as an impression. This person's just got an impression, this one's just got an impression, this one's got an impression. A view is when we click on the video and watch at least three seconds of the video. You really want to be collecting impressions rather than focusing on views. It means you're getting the rankings, but there's something not quite right. Often is down to the thumbnail. Your thumbnail is not clickable enough or peaking curiosity curiosity where people want to click on your video. If you are not getting any impressions, then you really need to start working on your titles and descriptions and stuff like that. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to like this video and follow this account. Best websites ever designed in 2021. Website one is called slaveryfootprint.org. Very simple, but pretty effective. Scroll well down, you can see it does all sorts of cool stuff. Website two is called blacknegative.com and you drag this like a slideshow. Very cool. Hover over here and it shows an image and a video. And website three is hellomonday.com. Scroll down, it's got all sorts of animations. Which one of these websites were your favorite? Leave a comment below and let me know. Here are perhaps some of the best websites ever made. Website one is called autodraw.com. Let's draw a smiley face. It's automatically detected it at the top and then I can just go ahead and select it and it will automatically create the face for me. Website two is called slides.com and this is to help present and create better pixel perfect slides for your presentations. Add your own custom code into this or use the pre-built templates. Website three is called screenshot.guru and this just makes it really easy to take snapshots of your screen. Enter the URL like so and then do screen capture. It's now taken a screenshot of that website we were just on. You can then right click on it and save the image. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to like this video and follow this account. Here's two clever websites for when you just want to be lazy. Website one is called dictation.io slash speech and this allow you to speak into your camera automatically write out with accuracy what you say. So here's an example. If you're enjoying these videos, make sure to like, comment and follow this account. Word to word, no issues whatsoever. Website two is called namecheck.com and this will search across domains and social media to see if you have a name you're after has been taken. Awesome content. Search and everywhere that's highlighted in green is available and the places that's not highlighted are not available. If you scroll down, it shows you where it's available on social media. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to follow this account and like this video. Three crypto websites that will make trading for you as a beginner 
ridiculously easy. This is Coinbase and it makes everything super easy. They literally just show the cryptos that have listed on the market. You would simply click the buy button and it will even hold the cryptos for you. The second website is also just as simple. However, instead of accessing it on a website, you would head over to the App Store and download it from the App Store. This will actually self-invest your crypto so you can earn a fixed fee per annum without really doing anything. It's as passive as crypto can be. Website three is called Binance and this is a great platform because this platform takes very low commissions and just like the others, you simply register, verify yourself and choose the crypto you want to gamble on and select the buy button. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to like this video and follow this account. If you're like me and you love buying softwares, you need to check out this website because it gives you lifetime deals, discounts, and exclusive softwares you can't find anywhere else. Now, if you visit clicky.info slash app 10, this is going to give you $10 of free spending when you purchase a software. Leave my referral link in the comments below. This website has tons of softwares and offers and all sorts of things that you cannot get anywhere else. These softwares will cover you from AI copywriting to SEO keyword research, YouTube video transcribing, and it even gives you access to stock image and video sites like 123RF and it gives you a lifetime deal access to over 170 million quality stock photos, illustrations, and vectors. This is actually a site that I use all the time to purchase new softwares, to create reviews for you guys. It's the real deal. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. This website will verify any statement ever made. Go to snopes.com. In the search bar, type a topic or question. Now find your question. It will even show you where the information came from. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video and follow this account. Easy Online Side Hustles Part 1 Watch me rank a video on Google and YouTube for the term Best Plumbing Services in Chorlton. First I upload a video to YouTube. Then I use one of my local business templated headlines for the title. Then I paste the headline in the title and create a short description. Now I'll add a thumbnail using one of my templated headlines. Next fill out the tags in YouTube. Finally, tap the publish button. Open up incognito mode on Google Chrome and type our search term in. Wow. Instantly on the front page of Google. Let's see the Google video tab. We are number one on Google videos. Let's see YouTube. And we are number four on YouTube. If 1000 people like this video and comment part two, I will show step by step how you can easily do this as well and start selling it to local businesses. Here is perhaps one of the most underutilized but most powerful way of ranking local businesses. If you're a digital agency, you're either going to love me or despise me. Let's head over to Google Chrome incognito mode and I want to show you some real rankings. Type in personal chef services Preston. Scroll down and there's a video of me. Videos and that's me as well. Change the geo to let's say Oldham. There's another video I uploaded. Hold on. Okay that's all good. That's for one service but let's switch a service and maybe try something like turfing. Turfing services Oldham. And there's my picture right there. Let's go to all and there I am as well. A multi-trillion pound niche and check that out. That's me as well. The question is, how did I get to the first pages of Google and YouTube? I just took the niche, added services onto the end, and then onto the end of that, I added the geo I wanted to rank for. Make sure to follow this account and happy ranking. Sometimes it's really handy being able to see where a website was to where it is now. Perhaps you had a website and you lost some information from that website and you think there's no way of getting it back. Here's a free tool that you can use that will find all the lost information that you once had on a website. This website is called archive.org or Wayback Machine. Let's go ahead and enter youtube.com, but this can be any website. Click browse history. This has logged nearly every single update YouTube has made since 2005. Let's head back all the way to 2005 and let's click May 5th. It's been 16 years since YouTube first launched and it's crazy to think that it's gone from this to this. 
For more helpful tips, online hacks and software reviews, make sure to hit the like button and follow this account. Here's a free tool that will help you understand your YouTube's analytics growth. This tool is called Social Blade and the way this works is you would simply paste in the URL of a YouTube channel. We're going to go ahead and use Jason Nash and do search. This will then show you all sorts of information regarding the YouTube account, the estimated yearly earnings and then a breakdown of daily views and subscriber changes and stuff like that. Even check out the future projections in five years time Jason's channel will reach 3.2 million subscribers then you can head over to detail statistics and this will show you the past 30 days of what's been going on with Jason's profile go ahead and check out this tool for yourself or if you want me to check out someone else's profile drop their name below thanks for watching and I'll see you next time here's how you can see how responsive your website is when people are looking at it from different size screens mobile devices or even tablets and the best thing about this method you don't need to use any third party website or purchase anything whatsoever. Here I am on one of my websites called clicky.info and as you can see this is the desktop version so I'm going to go ahead and right click on the screen click inspect and right over here I'm going to click toggle device toolbar. Now you can see that this is what it will look like on a Galaxy S5. We can in fact change and toggle this option by clicking here. You can customize it to let's say a iPad Pro or a Galaxy Fold or a Pixel 2 or even an iPhone X. Even change it to flexible responsive and now you can slowly drag or minimize how big this screen you want to the pixel. For more online tips, online hacks and software reviews, make sure to hit the like button and follow this account. How I make $3,000 plus per month. These are real results. Step 1. Find a product which has an affiliate program. Step 2. See what others in your niche are doing on YouTube. Step 3. Create a focused YouTube channel and post the same style videos talking about your product. If you want to learn this in more detail click the link in my bio to download my master list of resources. For more content like this tap the like button. How I make $3000 plus per month. These are real results. Step 1. Find a product which has an affiliate program. Step 2. See what others in your niche are doing on YouTube. Step 3. Create a focused YouTube channel and post the same style videos talking about your product. If you want to learn this in more detail click the link in my bio to download my master list of resources. For more content like this tap the like button. You want to know how much I've made for my small YouTube channel? Let's see if you can pause the screen fast enough. Don't spoil it for other people. Showing the picture in 3, 2, 1. Did you see it? If you didn't, rewind back and try it again. Insanely useful websites. Part 1. Go to Ninite.com. This website will let you tick all the softwares you want to download onto your computer bypassing the provider's website. Tick the boxes you want to download, and then click download. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video. Insanely useful websites. Part 10. This website will change your mouse cursor to almost anything. Select a cursor you like and click add. Refresh your page. How cool is that? Insanely useful websites. Part 11. This website will give you a glimpse of the future of any city. Hover over any of the points on the map, and it will provide a list of predictions. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 12. This site will turn YouTube videos into GIFs. Enter the video URL. Now select part of the video for the GIF conversion. Now you can download the GIF or share it via URL. Insanely useful websites. Part 13. This website finds the most ridiculous travel deals you can't find anywhere else. Enter your locations and press search. This site shows I can grab a flight from New York to London for just £170. So check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 14. This website will find you the phone numbers from big companies trying to hide the information from you. Enter the company name and then press search. You now have the relevant contact details. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 15. This website will tell you how long it will take to read a book from your reading speed. Enter the book title and search. Click test recording speed and start the timer. Then read the passage. Click stop timer when finished and now it will tell you how long it will take you to finish the book. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 16. This website will do the math for the times you should go to bed when you need to wake up at a certain time. Tell the tool what time you need to wake up at. Now click calculate. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 17. This website will give you any topic related icon or high quality image in just a search. Enter the topic and press search. 
Click on an icon and press download. Now change the search bar to images and press enter. This will show all the images you can download. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites part 18. This website will generate fake credit card information for you to test your payments on e-commerce sites. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites part 19. This website will email you when Amazon drops the price of a desired product you want. Enter your email for the notification followed by URL or name of the product you want to track. Now when the price drops you will get an email. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 2. EatThisMuch.com will help put your diet on autopilot. Enter how many calories you want to consume per day and how many meals to spread it across. Click Generate. This shows you a complete meal breakdown with recipes and step-by-step -step instructions for each meal. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like and follow this account. Insanely Useful Websites Part 20 This website will translate any typed text or text inside a document into another language. Enter or drag the text into box 1 and it will auto-translate the text into box 2 in your desired languages. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 21 this website will let you listen to radio stations all over the world. Simply drag the circle over any dot on the globe, and it will tell you where in the world you are, and what station you're listening to. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 22 This website will combine all the playlists of your favorite artists into one. Fill out each field and press the button. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 23 This website will let you make a playlist of all your relaxing natural weather sound effects. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 24 This website teaches you a new language. Select the language you wish to learn. It will then read out the words. You will then be tested on which word is correct for the context. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 25 This website will help you generate clicks to your campaigns by rating your headlines. Enter your headline and click the button. This isn't very good. Now watch me rate one of my tested headlines. Above average. Much better. Now my campaigns have a chance at success. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 26. This website will let you download any Twitter video. Right click on the Twit video and click copy. Paste the URL into the search bar and click download. Now you have the downloaded video. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 27 This website is the next LinkedIn. It will connect you with professional in any industry. No matter if you're looking to sell services, network with others, or finding a job, this site has all the features you would need. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 28 Will a robot take over your job? This website will calculate the probability of that happening. Enter your job. Now it will give you data, including the risk of your job being taken. Want me to see if your job is at risk? comment below insanely useful websites part 29 are you bored of zoom work meetings this website will let you freeze your camera making everyone else think you have a poor internet connection insanely useful websites part 3 this website will let you spy on all the money making keywords your competitors are using go to this website and enter the competition's domain this shows you the keywords monthly searches and their ranking position. This keyword gets over 340,000 searches per month. Now you know this. You can replicate it. Use my affiliate link below for 80% off and the lifetime offer. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like and follow this account. Insanely useful websites. Part 30. Did you know this website creates online CVs for free? Enter your basic information like your name, interests, hobbies, what you do, what you want people to do on your page, and a photo. Then you are given a shareable URL, which will take people to your CV. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 31. This Google Chrome extension blocks annoying ads when visiting websites. Click the button to one-click install, then go to a website, toggle the ad blocker, and refresh the page. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 32. Ever wondered where your competition gets all their traffic from? This website will tell you. Scroll to the bottom and enter a domain. This will now show you a variety of data to help you grow your own website. Insanely useful websites. Part 33. Are you looking to increase lead gen and sales for a business? This site will give you high converting sales templates for your marketing. By entering your email you will be given this free checklist. Go check it out.
Insanely Useful Websites Part 34 This website will give you over 4,000 free cheat sheets, revision aids and quick references in these almost any niche. Click one of the categories. Select which cheat sheet you want and view. You can even download the PDF version. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 35 This website will find out what other people's websites are built with. Enter the domain in the search bar and press lookup. This will now show you all the tracking integrations, what the site was built with, and other useful information. Go check it out. Insanely Useful Websites Part 36 This website will download any YouTube video for free. Enter the YouTube video URL of the video you want to download. Select the format, and then click Continue. Once it's finished loading, click the download button. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 37. This website has all the copy and paste characters you'll ever need. You can click on the characters to copy or filter the characters by category. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 38. This website will corrupt any file you upload. Click one of the buttons to upload your file and then click corrupt file. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 39. This website will make a downloadable CV for you. Enter your basic information, then your work experience, then your qualifications, followed by your interests, and then any references. Then click download. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 4. It will cost you £5.99 per month for a Netflix account. Why pay this when you can get alternatives for free? Go to alternativeito.net. Search Netflix. It will show free alternatives to Netflix. Click on one of the listings. You now have free movies and TV shows for life. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like and follow this account. Insanely useful websites. Part 40. This website will tell you if a website is down for everyone or just you. Enter a website and press enter. This site is up for everyone. Let's do another. This website is down for everyone. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 41. This website will help you draw diagrams. First choose a template and click create. Then use the drag and drop editor to customize the template. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 42. This website will allow you to search and keep your privacy at the same time. Simply use it as you would Firefox or Google Chrome and relax knowing your privacy is protected. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 43. This website will teach you another language for free. Select which language you want to learn. Say why you want to learn. Now it will test you in a multi-choice learning method. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 44. This website will help you create flowcharts. Choose which template you'd like or create one from scratch. Use the drag and drop feature to move and add things. You can even add text and customize it. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 45. This website is an all-in-one note creator. You can create notes from to-do lists all the way to essay outlines. You can even create sketches and add them to your notes. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 46. This website will allow you to create a personalized newsfeed about any topic. Enter your desired topic, and it will show you all sources talking about it. You can create as many newsfeeds as you wish. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 47. This website will let you upload and share files with ease. Click the upload button and select your file. Now share the URL. When clicked it will download the file. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 48. This website provides hundreds of free quality fonts for your web projects. Clicking on a font will show the different weights. You can then choose how you'd like to install the font. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 49. This website will translate any language to your speaking language. Enter your text and in real time it will translate. You can also select what language you would like to translate in. Insanely useful websites. Part 5. Search for manualslib.com. This website will find any manual in just a few clicks. Enter the name of the manual you want. Now you have your manual to read online, or you can download to read offline. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like and follow this account. Insanely useful websites. Part 50. This website will show you the most trending searches people are typing into Google. Enter your topic. This is the history from 2004 to now on how popular this term is. These are all the related terms of your topic. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. 
Part 51. This website will fix all your grammar and spelling. Create a new document and start typing. You can adjust tone of the writing and it will give you an engagement score. You can even check the plagiarism score. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 52. This website gives you real online privacy anywhere. Launch the app and select what destination you would like to be seen in. You're now hidden behind another IP address. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 53. This website will tell you how to pronounce any word. Enter the word. It will also share how to pronounce it from different regions. Go check it out. Insanely useful websites. Part 6. Grab the URL of any blog post online. Go to this website and paste it into article to video. In 30 seconds this website will auto-create a video using artificial intelligence. Here are all the scenes and you can easily edit everything in this area. Here is what the video looks like. Use my affiliate link to get the discount lifetime deal for this software. I've left the link in the comments below. Insanely useful websites. Part 7. Go to Instructables.com. This website is the ultimate site for people who want to learn how to make, well, anything. Then click on a project. It will provide you with step-by-step -step instructions, written and video-based. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to tap the like button and follow this account. Insanely useful websites. Part 8. This tool will save you a ton of time by telling you how hard or easy a niche is on YouTube. In other words it will tell you which video topics will be easy to get lots of views. Enter your topic in the search bar. It now says if the topic is easy to rank on YouTube or if it is too hard. It then tells you the best titles and descriptions. It will also estimate how many daily views you can expect for getting in the top 5 spots of YouTube. Visit grabbeadly.com for more information on this tool or click the link in my comments. Insanely useful websites. Part 9. This website uses artificial intelligence to write blogs. In the sidebar tell the software what you want it to write. Then click write for me. You now have done for you blogs. Go check it out. It's always difficult to determine if a website's not loading for you, if it's your internet connection, or if it's the website itself. So here's a free tool that will tell you if the website's down or if it's your internet connection. This tool is called down for everyone or just me.com and you would enter the website you want to check out. Here's mine, martingland.com, and then go ahead and click or just me. It will load and it will tell you if it's you or if the website's down. In this case, the website's up. For more online tips and software reviews, make sure to hit the like button and follow this account. Three websites that you can make a killing on in your spare time. Website one is called People Per Hour. This is actually one of the first websites that I started when I was 18 years old, which helped me make a few hundred pounds per week. I was charging like 80 pounds for a professional Facebook page that I could have created in Canva. Website two is called Fiverr.com and the best way to tackle this is go on to the top rated sellers see what they're selling and then use this as inspiration to sell your own related services this one service has sold 609 times and he charges 22 pounds just for the basic he's made at least 13,873 pounds since he does that one ad website 3 is called upwork and again you would just simply upload your profile or your portfolio if you have one and await for the customers to start rolling in more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video and follow this account here's a really cool meme generator website that's absolutely free and will help you make engaging memes for your social media pages this website is called capwing.com slash meme dash maker start creating memes all you'll do is either upload one of your files or choose one of the templates i'm going to go ahead and select this one then do edit this template this is a drag and drop builder so simply click on the text enter any text here you can change the colors to light dark or whatever you want and then just go ahead and do export this is perhaps one of the easiest ways you can create memes and the greatest thing about it is absolutely free if you've enjoyed this video go ahead and hit the like button and even follow this account here's a free tool that allows you to design almost anything let's head over to my screen and check it out this tool is called placeit.net and on this tool you can design anything from brochure designs logos videos banners and even if you wanted to set up your own t-shirt business this will actually help you do that all for free let's say you want to create a logo 
head over to logos and click on free logos right here you'll have a whole bunch of templates which can be filtered this logo here they've made it super easy to modify with the simple drag and drop editor just like so and on the right you have a bunch of images and customization features that you can simply click on and it will change the main logo for you when you're done just go ahead and click the free download button for more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video and follow this account here are two extremely powerful Google Chrome extensions that I generally don't know how I got by without them extension one is called my ad finder one click install it head over to your Facebook account in your toolbar over here you will see an icon called my ad finder click it show only ads automatically it's going to filter out all the friends and families posts and only show the ads that companies are trying to market towards you extension two is called what font one of the biggest things for good design is using good fonts one click install it to Google Chrome any website let's just go ahead and use Facebook in your extension bar you will see this icon here click it and then hover over any element on any page so let's go ahead and do this text here click it and it will tell you which fonts the backup fonts what style it is the weight the size the line height and even the color For more online tips and hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video and follow this account profitable business tools for online marketing this is my master resource list of all the tools i've used this year i've never shared this with anyone but i'm trying to help as many business owners as i can this year if you want this list of resources click the link in my bio to download it for free if this video has helped you don't forget to click the like button in the past 30 days i've generated 340,000 views on quora on a basically brand new account i want to show you how i filtered out the crappy rubbishy answers to the answers that are actually going to get you views here's my quora dashboard 340,000 views in the past 30 days Let's just change that to all time it's actually 390,000 views here's the little hack click on your profile ads manager don't worry we're not going to be spending anything quickly fill out this scroll down and click continue under choose primary targeting click on questions then click on bulk ads and type in a generic keyword and now it's showing you the most relevant questions but let's go on to something a bit more broad let's say you're in the finance game and now it actually shows you all of the weekly views that each question is getting to answer them simply click on them and then it will take you to the question make sure to like this video and follow this account review your youtube channel and give you some pro tips yeah no problem we're going to be focusing on a really hot topic at the moment and that's youtube shorts what youtube shorts are very simply youtube's way of mimicking tiktok you only allow 60 second videos this channel seems to be focusing on youtube shorts however the execution is not very good and i'm going to show you why it's created on july 11th which means it's been well over a month now since created and it's only had 77 views the description doesn't really contain any primary and second keywords youtube shorts it's not not entirely about SEO or about the headline if you compare the first two videos compared to the other videos you will see that the first two videos which is animal voice over and funny moment and again here which is kind of interesting because this person has replicated a working title the reason this has likely worked is because it's peaking curiosity with the headline what is that funny moment and that is where the curiosity and people are more likely to click so let me take this voice over copy it pull it into a tool called headlines.sharethrough.com it will analyze how attractive a headline is whether or not people are going to click on it this has got a average score of 64 which is actually not too bad if we compare it to this do analyze score shot all the way down and that's because there's no curiosity in this at all if you're going to be including hashtags make sure you do it in the description also in your description you've not included a description you're not helping youtube to determine what your video is actually about you no know, i just said that youtube shorts are predominantly about the headlines but every little helps and often when you do lots of little things it turns into one big thing putting tags in your videos and you need to make sure you're putting descriptions which include primary and secondary keywords also make sure you include hashtag short 
in your description which will definitely put it in the shorts category one final thing about youtube in general is they don't like random posting they want content creators to be consistent if you only have the time to post once a week post once a week post daily then post daily but do not post uh, two videos two weeks ago and then wait two weeks and then start posting four to five videos in a day and then tomorrow do two videos the day after do no videos etc youtube don't want to see this and it's just going to stunt your growth so create a content schedule how many videos is realistic for you to be posting a week or a month or whatever and stick to that schedule i do hope you've enjoyed today's tips if you would like me to review your youtube video go ahead and drop your comments below thanks for watching and i'll see you next time since releasing my video about how i generated 1.2 million youtube views in the space of 30 days i've had a ton of people ask me marty the copywriting tool that you've been using is a little too expensive for me are there any alternative it's not as good as the tool i recommend recommended but it certainly can help get the job done so let's head over to my screen and show you this tool you can find this tool by visiting clicky.info slash writer this is an ai copywriting tool by selecting your language change it to what sort of style tone you want it to write in start off with blog idea and outline primary keyword is teach a dog to fetch generate two outlines for me write for me we have a full-blown outline we're going to change this to blog search and writing i'm going to copy this title here paste it in like so do right for me and in just a minute or two we now have 412 words and a blog that can be used for our blog posts for our youtube videos or any sort of social media marketing for more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like this video and follow my account spying on joe biden's advertising Go to Google and type in Facebook Ad Library, then click on the first link. Filter the ads to show what countries they're advertising in. Let's see what Joe Biden is currently running on Facebook. And these are all the ads that Joe Biden is currently running on Facebook, as in actually paying money to get these ads in front of people. Let's try Donald Trump, and here's all the ads that Donald Trump was previously running on Facebook as well. Want me to spy on one of your competitors, or are you interested in a brand and what they're advertising? Go ahead and comment it below. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to like this video and follow this account. Here's a really cool tool that you can use if you suffer with procrastination, or you just feel disorganized a lot of the time. You can find this tool at clicky.info slash tasks this tool works on apple and android devices and using it is dead simple click the plus icon you want to create a task for walking your dog and these will pop up so click remind me and select tomorrow morning and do daily start reminding you every day add a tag then you can break it down into smaller tasks so for example put lead on dog walk for 30 minutes put alarm on before going out and then just do add you can just tick it off like so, walk dog, put alarm on. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to like this video and follow this account. It's a tool that's going to allow you to convert any blog posts or audiobooks into audio. More information about this tool can be found at clicky.info slash listener. This tool will allow you to create podcasts or voiceovers. So head over to voiceover, enter the text, choose your voice and click convert. Now when we listen to it, don't forget to like and follow this account. And when you're happy, press save. File will end up in your dashboard where you can edit it, download it, or even embed it directly into your website, which will look like this. You can even customize all the colors, create some nifty backdrop shadows. For the podcast, you will click create new show, import your own stuff, or create one from scratch. Even integrates directly with Canva, which will allow you to select these done for you templates. Click publish, and now you've got a podcast thumbnail. Click create show. Then you can do the exact same thing inside the podcast and create as many episodes as you want, which can be embedded anywhere. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to follow this account and smash that like button. Underrated websites, part one. This website will create any style sales text you need. It will even give you inspiration and ideas. Let's create a few marketing angles. Click the marketing angles template. Enter some basic information about your end goal. Then click generate content. This has generated four new marketing angles. Let's try something else like Instagram photo post captions. Click the new template and enter some basic text about the photo. Click generate content. You can generate as much text as you need. For more underrated website videos, make sure to tap the like button and follow this account.
Follow these exact steps to unsubscribe you from all of the spammers. Head over to saymine.com, click get started. Once you've connected your email, I've only got four companies that have my email address. It even shows you which companies have your information. And yes, I did like Minecraft. For more helpful videos just like this, make sure to like this video and follow this account. Underrated Websites Part 2 This website will turn you into a peeping tom. It will allow you to peek through people's real-life windows all over the world. Time to turn your cameras off. For more underrated websites, make sure to like this video and follow this account. Underrated Websites Part 3 This website will protect you from unsolicited emails. Simply copy the unique email from the website and enter it into a website, which is promising you something. Wait a few seconds and now you will see the emails rolling in. For more underrated websites, make sure to like this video and follow this account. Underrated Websites Part 4 This website will tell you the correct pronunciation of any word. Simply type the word into the website, and then press the play button. Discombobulated. For more useful videos make sure to tap the like button. Underrated Websites Part 5 This website will let you write a letter to your future self. Write your letter in the box. Then select the amount of time in the future. And then enter your email. Now in the next X amount of time this website will send you this letter. Underrated Websites Part 6 This website will tell you if any photo has been photoshopped. Grab a URL of a picture and paste it into this website. This will now show you all the subtle edits a picture has had. For more useful videos make sure to like and follow this account. Underrated Websites Part 7 If you want to predict the future, this site will help you do that. This site has been logging past, present, and future predictions for over 10 years. Almost every prediction by this website has come true, let's see what they predict in the next 10 years. The Arctic is becoming free of ice. Progress towards malaria elimination and the next generation for London's tube trains. For more videos like this make sure to like and follow this account. Underrated Websites Part 8 This website will automatically remove the background from your images in one click. To start drag your image into the website. Then the website will automatically remove the background followed by a download button. For more useful websites, make sure to like and follow this account. Underrated Websites Part 9 Type in Google if ttt.com Click the Create button and click Add. Choose the SMS option, then click Add. Now select Email. Leave the settings as they are. Now when someone texts you, you will receive a duplicate email just like this. For more content like this, tap the like button. If you're a content marketer or a business owner and you have been struggling producing content to help get seen online, you are going to love this tool. This is a text spinning tool and you can find more information about this at clicky.info slash spinner. The way this works is really simple. You would either paste your text into this article here or click fetch a new article. Let's pretend that I want to talk about spicy chicken wings and do fetch article. Now it's showing me lots of articles all about spicy chicken wings. I'm gonna go ahead and do this one here. And within seconds, I now have a recipe for spicy chicken wings. You can protect keywords if you desire by entering them here. Go ahead and do rewrite article. It has completely rewritten this article. Download hundreds, if not thousands of versions of this one unique article. Finalize article and click export. And each text file contains a unique article of what you've just seen. If you've enjoyed this video, go ahead and tap the like button. Here's three useful websites to check your internet speed. Website one is called fast.com. Click this button here, and within a matter of seconds, it will show you how fast your internet is. Website two is called speedtest.net, which is one of my favorite tools. Click go. This will check your ping, your download speed, and your upload speed. Even change the server to somewhere which is closer to you. Website three is called uswitch.com slash broadband slash speed test. Enter your postcode, select your broadband connection, say who's your current one, and then do start test. It will show you your download speed and your upload speed. For more online hacks and software reviews, make sure to like this video and follow this account. Websites to cure your boredom. 
Part 1. Go to RoomStyler.com. This website will let you create 3D models of your home, bedrooms and offices. Just drag your furniture into the canvas. Play with the camera angles. Give it a try, it's free. Websites to cure your boredom. Part 1. Go to StaggeringBeauty.com. Warning this may cause epilepsy. For sufferers, please change video now. This website creates a weird looking creature that avoids your mouse. By clicking on the screen will make it go psycho. If you enjoyed this video don't forget to like and follow this account. Websites to cure your boredom. Part 2. Go to theuselessweb.com. This website will open a new useless website every time you click please button. Let's click the button. Website 1 is useless books about teaching you how to play with lion's testicles. Website 2 loads a random man getting hit my a tentacle. Website 3 loads a never-ending scrolling dogecoin mountain. Go try it out. If you enjoyed this video make sure to like and follow this account. Websites to cure your boredom. Part 3. Ready to meet the real-life Peter Pan? Go to Pixieland Peter Pan on Google. This will take you to the real-life Peter Pan's website. You can even buy a photo with him. If you enjoyed this video please make sure to tap the like button and follow this account. Websites to cure boredom. Part 4. Go to koalas to the max.com. This website will multiply the circles each time you click them. If you do it enough times, it will generate a new picture. If you enjoyed this video make sure to like and follow this account. Websites to cure boredom. Part 5. Go to cat-bounce.com. This website will rain cats. You can any of the cats across the screen or throw them off the monitor. You can click the make it rain text which will overload your screen with falling cats. I'm baffled why this website exists but go check it out. If you enjoyed this video please make sure to like and follow this account. Websites you didn't know. Part 2. Go to internetlivestats.com. This site will show you every stat you can imagine about the internet. For example, 152 billion, 729 million, 208,000, and 33 emails have been sent today. For more online hacks and software reviews make sure to like and follow this account. Websites you didn't know. Go to zoomquilt.com, this site will show you the most trippy animations that may cause confusion. You can even change the animations from the sidebar templates. For software reviews and online hacks make sure to tap the like button. In this Word Hero review, I'm going to be showing you the inside scoop about everything you want to know about this AI content writer. So for those of you who don't know anything about Word Hero or even what an AI content writer is, let me give you a little bit of information about Word Hero. Word Hero is ultimately a copywriting assistant which will help you create blog posts, social media content, sales copy and even poetry if that's the sort of thing that you're into. Now before we dive into the admin area where you can watch me create a blog post, let's jump over to AppSumo to check out the lifetime offer. If you visit clicky.info slash word hero, it's going to bring you to the official offer page. I don't know how long this offer is going to be up for, however if you visit that link it will always take you to the best discounted price on or off AppSumo. They are currently offering a lifetime deal for $69 which is to celebrate the launch of Word Hero. Inside this you will get unlimited copy forever, access to over 40 plus writing tools, access to all future writing tools, access to a brand new long form editor and well all of these other options as well which I'll let you have a look in your own time. Now if you could do me a quick favour by hitting the like button of this video and subscribing to the channel it would be hugely appreciated and if you have any questions at any point go ahead and drop them in the comments below and I will be sure to answer you within 24 hours. Here we are in the dashboard of Word Hero and it's pretty straightforward. You have your main menu here, which is editor and history, 
followed by your account details and also further navigation regarding help area, roadmap and even the Facebook group. Then if you scroll down you've got the search function so if you need to quickly find a template followed by the categorized menu which will show you all the categorized templates that you can use. And if we scroll down, we have tons of templates that we can start using and to go through every single one of these would be counterproductive. So I'm going to go ahead and create a blog post as I would with any of my niche sites so you can see the power of Word Hero. So the first thing I'll do is click the editor because this takes you into the long form editor and on the left you can see we've got all of our blog posts. Now I'm going to go ahead and create some blog headlines first. Enter a headline. This blog is going to be about training a dog to sit and click write for me. It's now generated three titles for me and I quite like this one here. I'm going to go ahead and select it and then paste it into the title. Next I want to create a blog outline so let's go ahead and click the blog outline and I'm going to paste that title in like so. And if you wanted to customize this output further, click on these three dots here, and this is where you would customize stuff. Let's go ahead and do right for me. Now it's generated these two further results, and I actually like this one here, so I'm going to go ahead, click on that, and paste it in. Now I'm just going to tidy it. If you want to add heading tags, just simply highlight the text, and this little option will show up with bold, italic, hyperlink, uh, center align it or h1 and h2 tags i'm going to change them to h2 tags next i'm going to take the title again and go into blog intros and paste it in and then click right for me okay and out of these options i like this middle one i'm going to take teaching sit i'm going to copy it and i'm going to go into quora answers and then I'm going to paste that in and then I'm going to do right for me. Now I'm going to paste it in and I'm basically just going to repeat that process with the Quora answers. Paste that in, add a little bit more context to the, um, to the question. So the importance of reward and repeat with dog training. Click right for me, copy that. And now let me speed through this process until we get to the conclusion. So in this section here, it's kind of just thought, hey, this will be a good area for a listicle sort of item. So in the search writing tool here, type in listicle, and then this will generate a list. So I'm going to click list and then rewards for dog training and then click right for me. And as you can see, it's generated all of these lists. So I'm just going to go ahead and put all of them in which has now added them there. Okay, and then we go back to the Quora answer. Okay, and then once we get to the conclusion tab, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna save this document by using the right menu here. Then I'm gonna go into history and where I generated a blog outline, I'm gonna grab that again. I'm gonna copy this, go back to editor, click on the folder icon and then click on that file we just saved, which will now load all of this again. And in the conclusion, I'm just going to paste what we just copied. And then I'm simply just going to put in this article I've spoken about. And then we're done with that article. Now, before we end this Word Hero review, let's go over some of the other navigation as well. We've already gone over Home, Editor and History. Now, you've also got the Help area. So let's go ahead and select that. And this will show you all articles and how to use each feature of Word Hero and they're adding to this on a regular basis with video footage, etc. Next, they have the roadmap. This is really insightful for customers to see where they're going with everything. And as you can see, this is everything they've completed. This is the next uh, releases. This is what they're actually working on right now. And this is what's planned for the future. Uh, it's just really helpful and very transparent of a company to do this. And here's the Facebook group that you can join where they're constantly posting stuff. Uh, I would say it's a pretty active community and sometimes being part of these communities can just give you a whole different perspective to what you're doing uh, and often you have very experienced people talking about copywriting, um, people with years of experience, so they tend to pass on their wisdom and everything you do is enhanced. Overall, I actually think Word Hero is pretty decent for the cost. I mean, considering it's only $69, which gets you unlimited credits, unlimited everything. Now, there is a strong chance that this is going to change very soon. So if you do click on my link to purchase this and this offer is still live, make sure you get it because it's 
quite handy to have these sort of tools in the background for potentially when you having a tough month and you still need access to these tools but you know spending a monthly fee is a little too tedious at that point in time um, it's definitely a good tool to have in your toolbox do I think they're perfect right now no but they are new so they are constantly developing things and as you saw on the roadmap they have a lot going on which is always really good to see that does bring us to the end of this video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time eight days ago i started a brand new youtube channel and i've already been able to apply for monetization that's right in eight days from scratch brand new channel six videos uploaded over 1,000 subscribers now and over 4,000 watch hours I've been able to do. And it's a brand new method never seen before. Now I'm going to be revealing everything over the next couple of weeks. So make sure you follow this account so you don't miss out on how you can do this as well. Any useful gadgets, part one. This gadget lets me automate tasks. Each button you assign an action, like opening a group of email tabs, to turning off your studio lights. Let's go ahead and turn them back on. You can control almost any smart device in your household and automate any tedious tasks on your computer. It can be controlled on your mobile phone and you can customise the buttons as well as create different profiles so you can have a profile for editing music or general admin tasks. Here is the link to the model I have. Insanely useful websites part 55. This website will show you a colour wheel and it will help you find a complementary colour for your designs. You can even extract colours from images you upload. Insanely useful websites, part 57. This website gives you tools to manipulate files and HTML documents. Place your text into the file, click the remove tag button. It's now emptied all the tags from that text. Insanely useful websites, part 56. This website will solve almost any mathematical formula for you. Simply enter your question and it gives you the results. Insanely useful websites part 54. This website lets you upload images and host them for free. Click the upload button then drag an image. You now have a uploaded image. Wide range of options to share with your friends. Insanely useful websites part 60. This website shows you an interactive map of all the countries with their highest rated restaurants for you to eat at. Enter any country and it will show you a list of results relating to restaurants. You can also use the map for more visual browse. Insanely useful websites part 61. This website has a range of done for you video templates for all of your video needs. Choose your template, fill out some basic information and then download the file to use wherever you want. Insanely useful websites Part 58. This website will give you free step-by-step -step instructions on how to build any app. Click on tutorials and it will give you a breakdown of all the different apps you can make with step-by-step -step instructions. Insanely useful websites part 59. This website will help you fight back against hackers. Upload a file and they will try to decrypt it for you. They also offer a list of well-known exploits with the solution for it. They will also help you find the related authority in your country to report this crime. Insanely useful websites part 63. This website gives you free icons, illustrations and photos. Browse the images they offer click on the one you want and then you can download it in two formats. Insanely useful websites part 64. This website helps you make resumes. Choose one of the templates they offer, fill out some of your personal information, then click preview. You can have a full-blown resume without needing the tech knowledge to build one. Insanely useful websites part 66. This website helps you build fun little games without any coding knowledge. Choose one of the templates, then use the drag and drop editor to add things to the game. Click the preview button and play the little game you just created. Insanely useful websites, part 62. This website will find the quote you enter from any film on the planet. Insanely useful websites, 
part 65. This website is a resource of stock footage, audio and images. When you click on it, it shows you a preview and then it will allow you to download the footage. Insanely useful websites, part 67. This website offers 95 free writing and SEO tools. Let's try out the plagiarism tool, paste some text into it, click the button, and then it will tell you how much of this text has been plagiarized. Insanely useful websites, part 68. This website will let you highlight any part of a picture and make it disappear. Let's remove the hand and the hanger from this picture. I simply highlight it and it vanishes. Insanely useful websites, part 69. This website will find the solution for most textbook problems. Search for your textbook, fill out some information, and then it will generate an image of the solution. Insanely useful websites, part 70. This website will let you record high quality audio, interviews, and edit them all in one. We can even type our notes in and then click the button and it will generate a robot voice reading it to us. Insanely useful websites, part 71. This tool will help with all of your writing from blog posts to email creation. Here's me creating a blog intro. I first type in some information, click the generate button. I have these three different paragraphs I can use. Insanely useful websites, part 72. This website offers free tools to solve all of your file problems. Let's try out the URL to PDF converter. Enter a URL, for this case I've used an image, and now that image has been converted to a PDF format. Insanely useful websites, part 73. This website will optimize with hashtags and images all of your social media posts. Enter your text and links, select what you want it to do, click the generate, and then it will generate a fully optimized post ready to go out on any social media platform. Insanely useful websites, part 74. This website will let you cite websites, books, and journals. Enter some information, select your source, adjust the settings, and then you have your site ready to copy and paste. Insanely useful websites, Part 76. This website will convert any file into any other format you want. Upload your file, select what you want it to convert to. When it's done, a button will appear and you can download it. Insanely useful websites, part 79. This website will give you step-by-step -step instructions on how to delete your account on almost any platform. First type in the platform that you want to delete your account on, then scroll down and it will give you step-by-step -step instructions. Insanely useful websites, part 78. This website will help you design any sort of graphics you can possibly imagine. Select a template, then use the drag and drop editor, followed by the built-in stock image library. You can download or share this via URL. Insanely useful websites, part 75. This website will give you cheat notes on almost any topic. Enter the topic you want notes on, select it, and then it will show you all the notes and information that you need about this topic. Insanely useful websites, part 81. This website will let you upload files and then send them via email or via special URL. Enter the information and then upload your file, grab the link and share it with your contacts. Once they receive the email or link, they'll then be able to download the file. Insanely useful websites, Part 77. This website will help find images from where they originate from. Enter the image URL or upload it. Now it will show a list of all the places that image shows. Insanely useful websites, part 80. This website will show you all the land for sale in a specific area. Start by searching the area, scrolling through the results, select a land you're interested in, and it will show all the information. Insanely useful websites, part 84. This website is a free mind mapping tool. With a simple drag and drop editor, you can create large mind maps and interlink everything. Insanely useful websites, part 82. This website lets you download a Google Chrome extension, which will then let you highlight any part of any website. Click the app and highlight, and it will even store it in a special URL that you can share with friends. Insanely useful websites, part 83. This website will show you all the mortgage numbers that you need in order to get a mortgage. Fill out the specific information and click the button. It will show you the complete breakdown of what you'll need to pay. Insanely useful websites, 
part 85. This website will show you all the contact details, if any, for any domain name you enter into the search bar. Enter a domain name into the search bar and scroll down. If they don't have privacy protect on, it will show you their contact details. Insanely useful websites, part 87. This website lets you create beautiful designs and effortless promotions. Click the create a design button, choose one of the many templates, use the drag and drop editor to change text, colouring and place elements. When you're done, click the download button and then you have the file. Insanely useful websites, part 88. This website tells you if a website is secure or not. You enter the website URL, then it will tell you what's going on with it and it will even show you all the reviews of that website. Insanely useful websites, part 89. This website will turn your Google Slides presentations into GIFs and videos. Install it with the one click install, then head over to your Google Slides PowerPoint, go to add ons, and select if you want a GIF or video. In just a few seconds, you'll have a video file of your PowerPoint presentation. Insanely useful websites, part 91. This website lets you set up referral marketing campaigns in just a couple of clicks. Choose one of the many templates, Choose the goal and where it connects to. Fill out some basic information. And now you have a website you can send people to submit their emails. Insanely useful websites, part 90. This website uses AI to create full-blown blog posts. Select what sort of template you want. Fill out the basic information. Within a matter of seconds, you'll have a full-blown SEO-based blog post ready to go out online. Insanely useful websites, part 92. This website is a lead management software for almost any business size. Packed with features like automated holiday request processes and managing overtime, as well as an easy to use mobile app for your employees, it makes it easy to manage and track the ins and outs of all the employees of your firm. Insanely useful websites, part 86. This website is a directory of free royalty free images simply select which image you want it'll also show you similar images and when you're ready click the download button insanely useful websites part 93 this website uses ai to create social media content choose your format then use the drag and drop editor for design use the ai writer to generate sales copy now you have an optimized post that's ready to download or publish straight to your social media Insanely useful websites, part 94. This website creates simple and effective email signatures in just a couple of clicks. Use the drag and drop feature to edit and customize your email signature. When you're done, click the install button and it will generate the code for you to copy into your emails. Insanely useful websites, part 95. This website lets you record, transcribe and edit your video calls, presentations and meetings with ease. Start off by uploading the file, choose the AI option or the professional option. Then you can edit the transcription and then export each highlighted area as a single video file. Insanely useful websites, part 96. This website gives your business an unfair advantage by using AI to create ad creatives. Set up your brand information, choose the format you want the creatives to be created, enter some basic text so the AI knows what to create. You can upload any images or if you have products, you can have it remove the background automatically. Give the AI a few seconds for the creatives to generate. Now you have hundreds of creatives that you can start using all with different wording, different designs and different styles. Insanely useful websites, part 97. This website helps create and market courses and products in just one platform. In a few clicks, you can create full-blown websites, upload and sell your courses, include lessons, quizzes, and assignments to your students, set up custom payment plans, and it will even issue out certificates which are customizable for when a student completes a course. Insanely useful websites, part 98. This website lets you quickly create illustrations and photos like a pro. Using the drag and drop editor, you can add as many images, background colors, text, and even video inside this editor. You can then export this into a Photoshop file or PNG or any sort of format you need. Insanely useful websites, part 99. This website will give you access to a tool that allows you to scrape and extract thousands of business leads, including emails, phone, and social media contacts from yellow pages. Start the tool and fill out some basic information. You now have a full list of local businesses you can contact.
Insanely Useful Websites, Part 100. This website uses AI to write captivating articles on any topic. Select the language you want to write in, enter a blog post topic, copy paste the title into the generate introduction area, then copy paste the title into the outline area, repeat those instructions and you've got yourself a full blown blog ready to be indexed by Google. Insanely Useful Websites, 101. This website is an AI writer and SEO assistant all in one. Enter the title of the document and then press generate. Tell the AI how many words you want it to generate and just like magic, you have a blog post. They even have a built-in SEO grading tool to help guide you when writing the article. Insanely useful websites, part 102. This website gives access to an extension that will let you blur out any part of your screen. Activate the blur icon and then click on any element you want blurred. Insanely useful websites, part 103. This site helps generate sales and leads by using pop-ups. Choose a done for you template, then one of the themes, fill out the basic information, make some customized personalizations if needed, head over to your website, wait a couple of seconds, and then it pops up. Insanely useful websites, part 104. This website helps speed up the design process with thousands of ready-made templates. Choose a template and then use the drag and drop editor to drag elements into the editor and design your templates. When you're finished, you can download the file in any of these formats. Insanely useful websites, part 105. This website lets you create bookings and appointments in just a couple of clicks. Fill out some basic information about the appointment setting you want to make. Grab the URL of what we just created. And now you have a fully bookable form that you can send people to. Insanely useful websites, part 106. This website lets you build and use adjustable forms, no matter whether they're simple, donation, or subscription-based forms. Insanely useful websites, part 107. This website lets you create forms and quizzes in a really simple way. You can share this via URL and it's mobile friendly. You can add to the quizzes or form by clicking the elements in the drag and drop. You can apply conditional logic and you can even integrate it with a CRM software. Insanely useful websites, part 108. This website will tell you if your email account has been breached. Enter an email address and click pawned. Now it tells you how many times it's been breached and it'll even tell you the sites that the password was breached on. Insanely useful websites, part 109. This website will simplify terms and conditions. Download the extension, head over to a website that has terms and conditions, click the extension, and now it's bullet pointed and graded each term and condition in an easy to readable way. Insanely useful websites, part 110. This website will give you the latest news about cryptocurrencies, new coins being released. It's even started blogging about NFTs. Click on the article and then you have a detailed step-by-step -step guide on how to do that. Insanely useful websites, part 111. This website shows you all the free books you can get from the Kindle store and it categorizes them on the side. Go ahead and click on the first book and then you can download it from Amazon for free. Insanely useful websites, part 112. This website will show people how to search for something. Go ahead and enter your URL, press search, and then click get link. Then we enter it into your browser and now watch it guide the person with what to do. Insanely useful websites, part 113. This website will discover, search, and play any song. Enter some lyrics, and now it will show you all the albums with those lyrics in. Click on one of the albums, and this will show you where you can download it, and even all the lyrics and YouTube videos. Insanely useful websites, part 114. This website lets you create, edit, and deploy full stack apps. Select your framework. On the left, your files. In the middle, your playground. On the right, you have your live view area. Fork it, share it, and customize the interface. Insanely useful websites, part 115. This website shows you university courses, which you can learn for free. You can enter a topic or scroll down and see all the different courses. Let's go ahead and do a uncommon sense and then sign up to enroll. Insanely useful websites, part 116. This website will teach you something new every day. Sign up to one of the courses and then every single morning, it will send you a five minute cheat sheet of the thing it wants you to learn that day. Insanely useful websites, part 117. This website lets you generate fake data based on your production data. Fill out the information. You can add up to a thousand rows and then you can preview it and the raw data. And when you're done, you can download the data.
Insane Useful Websites Part 118. This website acts as a whiteboard for you to draw on. At the bottom you have your range of tools and this white area is your playground. Go ahead and use your mouse to draw. When you're done, share it with your friends. Insane Useful Websites Part 119 This website is an affiliate marketing platform to promote and earn a commission. Use the category area, scroll through all of these products, click on one of the products to see what it's all about, click promote and then it will generate a unique URL you will be able to earn an income. Insanely Useful Websites Part 120 This website is an anti-piracy tool that monitors your content 24-7. Add a website URL. If someone has stolen your content, click the manual request and then do submit URL. But under pending DMC takedown, requesting it to be taken down. Insanely Useful Websites Part 121 This website is an SEO checklist. Break down all the elements of your site and it will tell you what to improve and how to improve it. It will even show you the more technical things like structured data, page speeds and indexing, which of your pages are top performing pages and the breakdown of the traffic source. Insane useful websites, part 122. This website will write all of your blog posts. Enter your topic, choose the recommended keywords, under titles click generate, add it into your blog, click outlines and then generate, add it into your blog, double click the titles and do paragraph. Repeat the process, tidy it up and then you've got yourself a blog. Insane useful websites, part 124. This website will turn your text to voiceovers. Select the voice, enter some text, choose your language, generate voice, and then download it. Here's the link. Insane useful websites, part 123. This website will turn your text to voiceovers. Select the voice, enter some text, choose your language, generate voice, and then download it. Here's the link.